welcome to my art studio. Um, today I am going to be painting my four custom tote bag order and I decided that I want to show you guys how I paint it all the way from the sketch to the final last stroke that I put on this um, tote bag. So I'm super excited um, to be showing you guys how I'm going to be doing it. Finally making my first YouTube full video of how I paint a piece. Um, so I'm super excited. I hope you enjoy this journey as you see how I create it all. Okay, so I'm about to start sketching it on this piece of paper, but I'm guessing you're maybe wondering as why I'm sketching it on the paper and not on the tote bag. I'm not sure if that's how other artists do it, but what I've realized is sketching it on the tote bag, especially when the tote bag is like a really thick material and good material, um, it's really hard to sketch on it and it's really hard to erase the sketch when sketch once you're done painting it and there's some uh, pencil marks left around it. So I have come up with this like technique that actually has helped me in so incredibly much um, while painting these tote bags. So I'm going to start sketching it and then I'm going to show you how I transfer the sketch onto the tote bag. So the next step is transferring the paper, the the sketch on to the tote bag. This is the little bit tricky part and it's kind of difficult for me to explain it. I already got the hang of it, so I know it's kind of like what I'm doing um, and it's not as difficult. I'm gonna take you through it, like show you exactly how to do it um, so you can see how it all goes. But basically I'm going to be first lining it up on here like this making sure it's exactly where I want it to be making sure that both distance wise are, are the same on both sides here um, then I'm going to leave with a pencil mark a little mark where the paper is oh, on all four corners then I'm going to take the paper put it inside the bag and when I lift it to the window it, the paper kind of I can see where the paper is because of the light shining through the tote bag so I can see it where the paper is I'm gonna then line up the paper that's inside with the little marks I made on the outside of the tote bag so it kind of lines up together and then I'm going to trace it when I put it on the window so that way it's like easier it like I said it's a little bit difficult to explain hopefully that kind of made sense but no worries because I'm gonna take you through it right now
Okay, so I just finished transferring um, the sketch onto from the paper onto the tote bag. Here it is up close. It looks good. I kind of, once I was done transferring it, I went over one more time with the pencil just so it's more um, vigilant. So when I start painting it, I'll be able to see where I need to be painting it. So yeah, that step is finished. Now I'm on to painting the tote bag. I'm going to fast. I finally finished the tote bag. I love it. It came out to be perfect. I already even messaged the client. She loves it as well. She's actually given it as a gift to one of her really close friends. Um, I believe it's for Christmas that she's given it for. So I think it's perfect. She wanted something handmade, something thoughtful. And the her friend's favorite verse is the one that she picked and that's her favorite flower as well. So this is a perfect gift. I'm so excited for her to see it and for her to gift it to her friend as well. But I finally finished it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video um, of how I paint my tote bag and the whole process of it from start to finish. Um, be sure to like, hit the like button if you really enjoyed watching this video. And subscribe if you want to see some more future videos that I've got already so many planned. I'm so excited to make and sh share it with you all guys. Have a great day.